Yes, what's wrong? Huh? What's what's the matter? What? Read. Oh. oh, you want me to read you the book? That will that help? Okay. Um, sure. But we've already kind of read this one twice. Are you sure you want me to read this again? I, I you know what? I got a better idea. Why don't I tell you a story, huh? You want to hear us? No, I'll tell you a story. It'll be just like these in this book. You know, smile. You tell what you want. Okay, I'll tell you a story. I'm going to tell you a story about Cinderella. Well, Cinderella was this beautiful girl. And she had uh, really kind of like ruggedy clothes and raggedy hair and, and kind of like you, except she didn't live in a cave. Instead, she lived with her uh, really evil twisted stepsisters who are really mean and always getting up in her face and telling her what to do. And I mean, it was just crazy. If I were Cinderella, I would have bailed on them. Well, anyway, that's what Cinderella did. She got out of town. So she grabbed her little bonnet and her little blanket and her bag, kind of like a bonnet on your baby. <laughs> I mean, that bonnet, yeah. And she got out of town and she ended up in this log cabin with these really hairy dwarfs. Santa Small. And these guys were really funny. <laughs> and they used to get mad when Cinderella would eat their porridge. And she almost didn't make it out of there because of the really, really, really cranky one. Yeah. Crazy. So Cinderella, she decided to leave there too. And she was out on the interstate. And she was hitchhiking because she was ready to say, goodbye, I'm getting out of this town. Goodbye, I'm getting out of this town. <laughs> and guess who came to her rescue? That's right. The prince on his big, white Harley Davidson. Huh? Cinderella and the big biker dude rode off into the sunset. <laughs> and they lived happily ever after. Ever after. That's what happens. When you find what you want in someone, you find everything you want. And that person makes you completely happy. And you take care of that person and do whatever it takes to make them happy for the rest of their lives. <laughs>